here today with another thrift flip for you. Last time we were at the thrift store, we saw an entire aisle of amazing purses that just wanted to be made over. <laughs> and I think one of you guys even requested to do a purse makeover, so that's what our plan is today. Eye on the purse prize. Let's go. <laughs> What is this? Okay, we need a rug for the office and like this looks like not the worst. It's not chevron, but it's but it's, it's cool. It's Guys, one idea we have is to use animals in some way. We've done a couple already with like little animals. But what else could we do? Okay, if you guys saw our marble table video, you know that we were saying that it was a struggle to find contact marble paper in Canada. We just found like five rolls of it at the thrift store. Looking at the purses aisle this time. I just want some fanny packs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so today's haul includes some personal items as well as some items that we are gonna use for today's thrift flip. Um, I got this super cute leather, um, what is it called, fanny pack. We're trying to make fanny packs come back and be like a thing. They kind of already are, and this one has leather straps too. Sometimes this part is cloth. Mm -hmm. So this one's like super high quality, um, and I'm excited to wear it and not carry on a purse anymore. Very cool, and then I found this, which, I think, I feel like it's just for like paper files, but I'm gonna use this as a laptop case and it's very like minimalist and black and it like the way it opens is like metal and it kind of yeah. snaps shut. I don't know, I just I just liked it. And then lastly, for today's DIY, we wanna do a backpack made out of a purse. Like a mini backpack, you know those ones that are like super in right now, you guys know. You guys know. Um, and as a tip, we found this like in the purse aisle, but also satchels like side satchels, mm -hmm. they kind of like look like a backpack because they have like all the little like zippers and stuff and they often have that like flappy over part mm -hmm. which makes it look like a backpack. So you can look at the side satchels to turn into a backpack and this one's kind of like just a really basic purse but super cute and minimalist. Um, there are so many like this mm -hmm. and there's like so many because it's kind of out of style now but they're the perfect base to turn into a mini backpack so that's what we're gonna try and do today. Yeah we also got this um, leather belt that we're gonna cut apart to use some, as some extra straps mm -hmm. um, and basically turn it into a mini backpack. All right let's see what we can do. So as you guys can see our new purse here is not so new. It has a little bit of dirt and dust and some grimy spots so we want to get rid of that before we turn this into a super cute backpack. So what we have here is just some warm soapy water, nothing too crazy. Uh, and taking some paper towel, we're gonna give it a nice little sponge bath or paper towel bath. So now that our bag is looking a little bit more new and shiny, uh, we're gonna start putting this together. The plan is to use the back strap as like extra material and to use the front strap oops, as our two straps. Since we already have this nice like deckle here, we're gonna cut this baby in half. Oh my gosh, it's so backpack already. And these guys, we just kinda need to like either cut off or seam rip out. Looking pretty good, eh? We could just do this right here if we were a child. <laughs> but we're not. We're gonna need longer straps than just this. Let's go ahead and cut this guy in half. So taking our little strap here, uh, we're going to secure it down here at the bottom this way so that when we wear it, it'll flip up like this. And now just taking a needle and thread, I can secure it. Okay, so both straps are now sewn on. You can see we just put a couple stitches there and then they're gonna flip up like this when you're wearing it. And it looks pretty profesh if I do say so myself. So once we have it on and kind of spaced out, we can see that actually pretty much just need to sew them together and not there's not much overlap for it to hang properly on my back. What's that Shawn Mendes song? But when I'm without your kisses I'll be needing stitches. So all done sewing our little strappies on and it's looking like a backpack. So then our last step was maybe adding a piece of this belt on just because pretty much all these backpacks have something that goes like this way. So let's try cutting this off. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm all done stitching it up there at the top and down here at the bottom. And hot damn, this little minimalist backpack is looking cute. But the very last step is to add our little faux fur pom pom. If you guys haven't seen this video and you want to know how to make this, go check it out. It's so unbelievably easy. Just attach that little guy for the final touch. And oh my god. And the last step is to model it. Becky? Yeah, look gorgeous. Thank you. Oh my god, we like actually match so well. This is our fur DIY. <laughs> There's like fur floating in the air now. This is our little fur baby. Fur baby. The fur family. And then this is fur sheepskin sheepskin DIY. Sheepskin. Oh my, I can't even say it now either. <laughs> sheepskin <laughs> sheep DIY. Sheepskin DIY. Fur DIYs. Go check them out. But anyways, about this DIY, which I mean, we really care about. <laughs> so cute. This is how our bag turned out. You guys obviously saw that already, and we love it. It's adorable. Yeah, and you know what? We decided we love it so much that we want you guys, one of you guys to have it. <laughs> our family of bags is too big already, but this is too cute to just like not- Sit in a closet. Yeah, exactly. So we want to give this away. So what we're going to do is make a cut down version of this video. It's going to be on our Facebook page. So head over there, just share that video and let us know that you want to win it and we'll pick someone. Yes. Yes. So this guy can have a home. Aww. And it'll come with a little fur baby too, so that can have a home as well. Fur baby is so cute! Fur baby is so cute! Alright, well thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let us know what you'd like to see us do for our next theme for next thrift flip. If yes. If you have like a certain part of the home or a certain clothing item you want to see us try and like do a thrift flip for, let us know because we always take your suggestions for those. Yes, we do! And uh, to end this video, if you like this video, make sure that you like it. And if you love it, make sure you sub it. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.